welcome to maths is easy hello friends as there is always a need of help in calculating or solving mathematics questions on different levels i am here for the same today in this video i am going to solve chapter integers class 7 exercise 1.1 question number 8 to question number 12 publication house goel brothers so if you guys want to see the solutions of earlier questions, you can go by the playlist of integers where all the solutions are given. Moreover, if you guys want to see the solution of same publication house of class 8, you can go by the playlist where all the solutions of chapters are given. So let's not to waste further time. Check it out how to solve question number 8 to question number 12. So question number eight says from the sum of 233 and minus 147 subtract minus 284. First of all, we will find out sum of what 233 plus minus 147. In our next step, 233 minus 147 so the subtraction will become out as 86 now further we have to subtract it we have to subtract minus 284 from this sum so subtraction we will write so we have to subtract minus 284 from 86 like this. So further 86 minus minus will become plus 284. So our answer would be coming out as 370. Hope the question is clear. If any type of doubt is there, feel free by commenting into the comment box. So this is our answer. Now come to our next question. That is question number nine. So question number nine says, Find 36 minus minus 64 and minus 64 minus 36. Are they equal? So what, how we will do? We will write LHS from left hand to left hand side and RHS to right hand side. So LHS we will be taking as 36 minus minus 64 and RHS we will be taking as minus 64 minus 36. So here it will be coming out as 36 plus 64 and it will be coming out as minus 64 minus 36. In our next step, it will be, it will become 100 and it will become minus 100. So we can say that LHS is not equal to RHS, so they are not equal. Hope the question is clear. So we can here prove this only by doing the calculations. Now I have a full glance of question number nine. Now come to the question number 10. So question number 10 says, If A equal to minus 8, B equal to minus 7, C equal to 6, verify that A plus B within bracket plus C equal to A plus within bracket B plus C. And this is also a hot question. So let's see how to solve it. Here we are supposed to take A as minus 8, B as minus 7 and C equal to 6. Now. 
we will write LHS, we will write RHS. So LHS may be equal to A plus B as given in the question and RHS A plus B plus C. So in here we will put the values first. So our A will become minus 8 plus minus 7 plus 6. And in here minus 8 plus minus 7 plus 6. In our next step, it will become minus 8 minus 7 plus 6. And in here, it will become minus 8 plus minus 1. In our next step, minus 8 and minus 7 will become minus 15 plus 6. And in here, it will become minus 8 and minus 1. In our next step, it will become minus 9 and it will become minus 9. So here we can say LHS equal to RHS. Hands proved. Hope the question is clear. We have to do what we have to put the values according to the equation given to us and solve the question or calculate the question. So accordingly, we will be coming out as LHS equal to RHS. That is, that was asked to us. Now come to the question number 11. Have a full glance of question number 10. Question number 11. Now question number 11 says, if a equal to minus 9, b equal to minus 6, show that a minus b is not equal to b minus a. So in here, we will be assuming a as minus 9, b as minus 6. So here LHS and in here RHS. So a minus b and here b minus a. So A minus B will be equal to what? Minus 9 minus minus 6. And here it will become minus 6 minus minus 9. 